they did a great job about keeping everyone out of their seats and dancing. Um, at one point I managed to make it on stage and it's kind of all a blur to me. <laughs> Starting with Ben's wedding, how was it? I know you oh. and from the bachelor live on stage, right? Cause you danced mm-hmm. and then you were at the wedding. I mean, it looked incredible. There was about 75 bachelor people running around. Yeah. There's I a lot it. of people. <laughs> Um, it was incredible. I, I got, like you said, really close to Ben um, from doing tour and Jess because she would come and visit for longer periods of time. Um, we were only on tour for a month, but we really did build strong relationships with Ben and then Becca and then all of the dancers that were on tour. I was dancing um, for the tour as well. So, yeah, we really got to know each other really well and became good friends and just kind of stayed in touch even after the tour ended. Just we had this little family that we built on tour, which was great. And as well as that, like we would go to different cities and we got to meet different bachelor people, some that I had met before or some that I had not met ever, like from like way past in the back um, season. So it was a great experience and I felt honored to be invited to his wedding. Cause I know that was like the event yeah. <laughs> of a, a lifetime. It felt like, cause I, I mean, we, there was a lot of drinking that was had, but I, I, my boyfriend came with me and I was like, do you realize what this event is? <laughs> <I'm so laughs> we will like, be in people magazine. Yeah. I, I mean that, that he actually learned, he was like reading spoilers and things about the wedding and um, we heard people was covering it. So he was like, oh, okay. So People Magazine will be in there this week. Yeah. That's kind of interesting. And it's funny because he doesn't care about any of like meeting people that are famous or mm-hmm. considered well-known if you consider bachelor people that way. So he was just like very cool about it. And I thought he'd be more nervous than he was, but he was just like, you know what? They put their pants on the same way I do every single day. So it's going to be fine. I was like, okay, cool. That's a great attitude about it. But yeah, there was tons of bachelor people there, I guess. Someone had said that Ben originally wanted to invite like 800 people. Like the list was insane. Mm -hmm. And there were still a lot of people there, but they had to like cut that in half. So I, again, felt honored for being invited. But yeah, there was everyone that you could pretty much think of. Like every corner you would turn, you'd see someone from the show. Like there was even people that I remembered from like Paradise a long time ago, but I couldn't remember their name. So Mm -hmm. I was like, like Elise was sitting next to me at the wedding was like, who is, do you remember him? Like, I know his face. I don't remember like what show he was on. It's just like really funny. But yeah, we had a great time. They did a great job about keeping everyone out of their seats and dancing. Um, At one point I managed to make it on stage and it's kind of all a blur to me. I Um, I guess there's videos of it. I don't know if I ever want to see that video. It was a great time. I mean, drinks were flowing. I had poured my many drinks on myself. So by the end of the night, I was covered in my own drinks. And then that's a sign of a good time. Yeah, it was a good time. And the photo we took for people, I was again, covered in my own drinks. So it was just like very humbling, Um, but it was just awesome to just celebrate them. They're such a wonderful couple and like very inspirational and the, especially the actual wedding, they had three different uh, pastors that were special to them and the things that they said about them and then the way they brought everyone in, in the room and just like the love that was poured around the tent that they had was so beautiful to witness and just a great experience. And it was at Reba's old house apparently. Yeah. So, so cool. Like I talked to Ben. <laughs> I just had, I'm a survivor playing in the background of my head. The entire <laughs> oh my God. Time. <laughs> Reba theme song over and over again. Yes. I yes, talked yes. to Ben like two weeks before the wedding and he couldn't even remember all the people that were invited. Like he was like literally like looking for Jess, like through the window to try to like give him answers. And she yeah. wasn't there. it was so funny. And then I also talked to someone who was at the wedding and they were like, it was so big that it was like, if you wanted to avoid someone, you could, but everyone was nice. And I was like, I want to hear that somebody got into a fight. Just kidding. I don't actually want that to happen. But yeah, everyone I don't, said like, that everyone got Everyone along. was very happy. I mean, I think the alcohol had a lot to do with that. Because I, I know there's like people who dated in the past that were there. And like, that's weird. But I don't know. Bachelor's a weird little family that you kind of get over things like that pretty quickly. Because yeah. you end up running into them anyways. So yeah, there was nothing weird about that. It was just really all about like having a good time celebrating them. And yeah, just pouring drinks on yourself you know just like living it up yeah and it's funny because all the bachelor people are kind of in one corner whether that was intentional or not we just kind of all were in the same area so i guess that happens with the people that you know yeah that's awesome it looked like a great time 